Yo guys, what is going on? Back with my latest video. So today I have another mystery box video. This is from Chalice Collectibles. They did a mystery box, I think it was a week or two ago, um, where they let you choose the theme of the box. I think it was between Marvel, Disney, and anime. Um, so me, of course, I chose anime. Um, hopefully there's something good in here. I don't think they reveal what the grails were, so they're gonna be a surprise. So let's get right into it. Alright guys, so before we get into this video, please smash that like button down below. Let me know you guys are enjoying these videos, and as always, if you're not already subscribed to my channel, hit the subscribe button and hit the bell notification so you're updated to my most recent content. So like I said, this was a, I think this was 50 bucks, 60 bucks, I forget. Um, but they had a theme, like I said, Disney, Marvel, or anime. I'm still looking for Massa Chaco and a few other um, anime grails so i figured i'd go get the anime box and test my luck with that hopefully i don't regret that i've seen a few people pull some cool things from there um i've seen somebody get a disney box i think they had a bambi which is something i've been looking for um but anime was my choice so it looks like chalice has some new uh branding which is really dope um i do like that box it's pretty cool so let's open the box and see what is in here so I'm gonna do these one by one. I guess there's one soft protector. I think this is soft protector too. So two soft protectors. That's normally how they do it. They do uh, four commons and two exclusives, uh, either chase or grail or chase or uh, yeah, chase or exclusive. So first we have Deku. So I have this one already. Um, it's right back in that case right there. Um, Deku is one of my favorite characters on My Hero Academia. If you guys have not seen, seen that show yet, definitely one to check out. Um, I actually am starting to like it more than Dragon Ball Z, which is crazy for me to say out loud, but it is a really dope show. Check that one out. Um, the characters on all, all the characters on there, they actually develop pretty well. You kind of start to like all the characters in the show instead of Dragon Ball Z, where they kind of just focus on uh, Goku, honestly. Um, but there you go, there's the Deku uh, training gear. From my hero academia it's a duplicate so if anybody's interested please let me know all right so the second common well, i think i'm gonna get a lot of duplicates i do have a lot of the anime pops okay so the second co uh, comment is weiss from dragon ball z uh, dragon ball super i do i do have weiss so this one is also a duplicate which i figured i'd probably get some duplicates but the grails i thought i might um get lucky because i'm still missing a whole lot of the anime grails but Whis is dope. Um, he's one of the strongest, if not the strongest character in Dragon Ball Super. Uh, if you guys haven't checked out Super yet, really dope show. I think it's coming back out this year. Um, there you go. Not much more to say about Whis. Uh, it's really cool pop. Did a really good job with this one. And Dragon Ball Z is one of my favorite shows, so can't complain about that. Here is the third pop. This one's got a little bit of weight to it. Okay. Um, so this is Suyu from My Hero Academia. She's back there somewhere as well. So three for three are duplicates, which is not surprising. Not mad at that at all. Um, but yeah, she's a cool character in the show as well. She's got like uh, powers to make her basically a frog. So anything a frog can do, she basically can do. Um, each character on My Hero Academia has a, they call it a, um, what do they call it? <laughs> they call it a quirk. They call it a quirk. <laughs> I just forgot about it. Um, so each character only has a quirk, which basically is a superhero, a superpower, and uh, hers is being a frog. Which, if I did choose any superpower, it wouldn't be that. But she makes it work. So uh, there you go. That is the third common from this box. So here's the last common. Hopefully this one's not a duplicate. Hopefully I can add uh, one to my collection. This one's heavy as well. Okay, yes. So this is one I've been looking to add. I don't know why I haven't gotten this one yet, but I'm really happy I got this. Uh, the Blue Eyes White Dragon from Yu-Gi-Oh. So I grew up playing Yu-Gi-Oh as, as a kid. It was always Pokemon and Yu-Gi-Oh. Pokemon, I never really played the card game. We all collected them, but very few of us ever actually played the game. But Yu-Gi-Oh, they could catch that work with Yu-Gi-Oh cards. <laughs> uh, Yu-Gi-Oh was a really dope show. Um, even better card game. 
Uh, this one I've been wanting for a while, so I want to complete the set with Yam uh, Yami Yugi, Seto Kaiba, and Dark Magician Girl. I'm surprised they didn't make like Dark Magician or um, you know Exodia, some of the other Yu-Gi-Oh. Maybe they will in the future. But this one's really dope. This is the one I wanted most out of the set, so glad to add this to the collection. So there you go. That is the last common, and it is not a duplicate, and I'm glad I got it. So here are the two exclusives. Neither one is in a hard stack, which isn't a bad thing. Maybe they don't put them in there. Um, but let's see how we go. But these here is the first one. Oh, this is Super Saiyan Vegito. This is the Hot Topic exclusive. I guess this was an overseas um addition because there's no sticker but this one is signed um can't really tell who it's signed by i think it's probably from the voice of vegeta chris sabat uh let me see yeah because i had the majin vegeta back there and it is the same same exact signature so that's cool this is my second uh dragon ball z signed pop by chris sabat um, really cool. This is really nice grail to add to the collection. This is going right in there. Um, I do have this pop already, so to have an autograph version of it is pretty cool. So, really, really nice. Really appreciate that chalice. This is one I'm definitely going to add to the collection. And this is why I did get uh, this to add to the uh, this box. The theme was anime, and I uh, was really happy um, to add this one to the collection. So, that is the first exclusive. Let's see what the last one is. There is a pop god. This is Masachako. Yo. Yo. Yo, yo, yo. Woo. If you guys have watched my videos, any video I've ever talked about getting a pop, this has been my holy grail. And really, it's because my holy grail, because I have not gotten it. It's missed, um, it's fallen out of my grasp so many times. This pop has actually gone up like in a hundred bucks in value since I first started looking for it. Wow. This makes me very happy, which is weird. <laughs> This is Master Chaco from My Hero Academia. This is a San Diego Comic Con exclusive from 2017. Man, this is probably my favorite pop in my collection now. I've been wanting this pop for almost, what, 2017. Man, Chalice, you guys looked out. I'm like kind of lost for words. I don't know why I'm lost for words for a piece of vinyl, <laughs> but I am. I really just wanted this one for a long time, and it is. You know, a lot of satisfaction when you finally get what you want. So I do these mystery boxes, you know, I, I'm i cheap. So, you know, I don't want to pay, I think it's like 250 bucks or something like that now. I don't know. You guys saw, but I'm not paying 250. I'll pay about like, somebody in my video asked before, what's the most I'll pay for a pop? I don't know, probably 40, 50 bucks at most. <laughs> I'm not really uh, one to, you know, dish out a whole lot of money for a Funko Pop. So to get this in the mystery box, I am beyond excited. So... This made my day. Um, please let me know in the comment section below how you guys feel about this video. You already know what my favorite one is. This is going right in the collection, right in the hard stack. Man, Chalice, Chalice, Chalice. Check them out. I am not regretting my decision to anime at all. There you go, guys. Always rate, comment, subscribe to my videos. Thank you so much. Till next time, I'll see y'all later.